So here in Grand Theft Auto 5 Online, it's going to be Valentine's Day all week long, which means we're going to be taking advantage of triple cash and double cash and the RP that's going to be going on. And we're going to be talking about these. I'm going to be covering these jobs here. So right here, adversary mode, we got tell death, do us part. I think there's about eight of them in here. I haven't played all of them, but it is potentially a decent way of making some money. And we'll be talking about that as well. So there's like some more up here, it looks like, and it does take four plus players so if you just happen to have four players and one of those players leaves most likely what's going to happen is it's going to kick everyone else out because that's what happened to us for one of them here's another one right here this is a death match and it is called shotgun wedding so same same thing that's going to be happening here and unfortunately i didn't think that we actually had a chance to play shotgun wedding couldn't get enough people together and it only takes four people but nobody really wanted to play that death match because i think everyone's really kind of you know concerned about their kd potentially not quite sure about that one all right so anyways from there here's the other one that we'll be talking about also is going to be and i'll be showing you like the payouts here is going to be the stunt races right now which is actually the transform races in stunt races dishing out double cash and double rp but we're going to be looking at the triple cash and triple rp going on right now so this is until death do us part which is basically it's an adversary mode but it's just a death match i don't know why this isn't a, in like the death match session like section itself because it is uh you know it's just you and you're going to be on a team teams could be split up but the whole goal here is you got to go after the enemy and take them out. That, that's it. And I can't really understand why this is in the adversary mode section. And it is not considered like a death match because it really feels like a death match. Once again, we're not going to be able to show the payout for, you know, the shotgun wedding. Once again, couldn't get enough people in there. But we did get enough people in this one right here. Just to go ahead and try it out. So winner right there of one round. This is how much money you're going to end up making is a little over... Twelve thousand dollars right there that's if you're the winner and if you're the loser you can see right down there that it's only like you know eight thousand or something so right there there they are going in for the win oh yeah i got the green team and then there it is so yeah it's basically like just a death match or something and then right there two rounds ended up getting a little over thirty three thousand dollars right there but we didn't take very long to do this like considering it was probably like you know a couple minutes per match so in like what five minutes or something like that we ended up making you know a little bit of money and had a little bit of fun doing it also and these are just random players by the way like i don't i don't know any of these people necessarily we were just uh you know randomizing and getting together and trying to make some money but it looks like we were on the winning team so that's pretty cool all right so unfortunately yep no shotgun wedding but i'm just assuming it's probably going to be dishing out the same amount of money because it's also triple cash and triple rp but until death do us part there's going to be a lot more different ones than that you guys can go in there and then this right here uh so i spent about 13 minutes probably well a little less than 13 minutes and i'm doing a transform race and i'm doing it solo and i just want to remind you too if you're doing these transform races and you're doing them with a lot of people and you're in first place you're gonna end up making a lot more money than I'm gonna end up making right here. But this is just like a solo run and once again. I did like two laps right here and I just wanted to go ahead and look at the payout to see if this is even worth doing this week. And then also, once again, we're in the stunt races so transform races do get you extra RP by doing tricks. So let's check this payout real quick. Got first place because once again, I was solo. I was in there for about 13 minutes just messing around. And then from there, it looks like I made almost $25,000 a little over $24,000 right there for two laps and about 13 minutes I probably could have made the same amount of money just by doing one lap in a shorter transform race But once again, I was in there just messing around and getting some RP So, you know, you're gonna have to differ between the two whether you could be going in here and doing a bunch of transform races Which I'm sure there's gonna be an enormous amount of people right now doing both of these things potentially except for shotgun wedding couldn't get one of those going on for some weird reason uh but yeah so you know taking advantage of the triple cash and the triple rp double cash and double rp is uh you know something really good whether you're an existing
team player because with these payouts and I was grinding like half of a day or something like that, I could come up with a million dollars for sure. I could see myself doing that and then getting, you know, a business or buying something in the game that's going to help my character out and make more money later on down the road. So anyways, from there, yep, just want to go ahead and cover the top three ways of making money and ranking up this week in Grand Theft Auto 5. So just like always, if you guys enjoyed the video, please hit that like button on the way out. It helps the channel and think about subscribing, of course, if you are new. But from there, thanks for watching the video and supporting the channel. My name is Gravesite and I'm out of here. So peace.